Tucker Carlson's remarks on Donald Trump's assassination attempt touch upon core values of bravery, leadership, and resilience. These comments delve into the emotional and psychological impacts of Carlson's narrative, highlighting how it aligns with conservative ideals and strengthens the connection between Trump and his supporters. Tucker, the past 24 hours has been wild. The amount of news that has come out. How did the attempted assassination on former President Donald Trump change this election? Well, Trump won when that happened um, because he displayed physical courage. And, you know, if you live in a society where people are literally dating by remote virtually and working virtually, you can kind of lose touch with the physical reality of life. But the unchanging truth is that leadership requires courage and not just abstract courage, moral courage, uh, but physical courage. You know, someone starts shooting a rifle. Like, are you going to wet yourself and start crying and run away? Or are you going to stand up and look at your people and raise your fist and say fight? And very few people are capable of doing that. And he is. And um, yep. therefore he wins. Because that supersedes all this nonsense that we talk ourselves into believing is important. <laughs> no, the guy got shot in the face. He stood up with blood streaming down the side of his head, blood on his hands and said, fight, totally defiant. That's an act of undeniable courage that was not staged. You couldn't stage that. Um, and that man is the leader and he wins. And by the way, notice what happens to everyone in the crowd. When a leader is strong, his people are calm. His courage gives them heart. That's true for a father and it's true for a president. So yeah, he, he, he just won and he deserves to win. Like that, was the, that was the ultimate test. Carlson's observations underscore essential virtues like physical bravery, leadership, and resilience. They emphasize the importance of a resolute leader capable of facing adversity head on. His portrayal of Trump's response to an assassination attempt as an act of physical bravery aligns with these values, showcasing Trump as a true leader in a crisis. This depiction focuses on the deeper personal facets of bravery and authenticity. Trump's emphasis on personal courage and the genuineness of his reaction is highly valued. The notion that leadership demands both moral and physical courage echoes the belief that challenges must be confronted directly and authentically. Trump's reaction exemplifies a person who faces life's absurdities and dangers with determination. The emotional and psychological effects of Carlson's portrayal of Trump resonate with the audience. Carlson's description of Trump as a physically brave leader inspires respect and loyalty among his supporters. Trump's narrative, which involves standing and rallying the crowd despite being injured, reinforces his image as a strong leader by creating a vivid picture of strength and resilience. These images deepen the emotional bond between Trump and his supporters, making them feel more secure and motivated. The public response to Carlson's comments is likely to be polarized. While Trump's supporters may feel validated and inspired by his portrayal of bravery, critics might view it as an exaggeration or an attempt to manipulate public perception. The idea that Trump's physical courage won in the election will be seen by his supporters as a crucial moment to reaffirm their faith in his leadership qualities.